when you look at that wicket, at times you can you can be a little bit daunted by it, by the colour of the grass. But it was, um, yeah, I thought we, we played reasonably well in that first session to to get through unscathed. Yeah, I thought we batted really well today. Um, it's always tough to judge a wicket until two teams have batted on it. To be fair, uh, I think when you when you win the toss and bat, I think that obviously to get through the day. Five six down is is a goal, um, not so much not so much runs as opposed to to the position that you you see yourself in the game and um, no doubt the, the wicket there was some challenges at times we saw the second new ball went around a little bit even the old ball which was which was um, went around a little bit so it's just it's going to be one of those really real games that is an absolute grind um, for both sides. <laughs> I think Marcus Harris getting bumped out by a 100, 100k off spinner um, might have been the first time for that for a while in Test cricket. Um, I think the bounce that Nathan will get will be will be crucial on this wicket. We saw when Vahari bowled that fuller length; it was it was tough. There were some chances created for the for the left hander. So I think Nathan will will enjoy bowling on that. Like I said, some of the balls today. Have to be in brilliant nick to nick them. Um, I think coming round the wicket to left handers and straighten them, straightening them, straightening them so much is it's a huge asset to have. Feel as though you're that you're playing really well and to keep him out, but but the scoring options just aren't there as much as you would like to try and get on top of him. So he's just a world class bowler, which you expect. <laughs>